There's an enormous amount of science involved when Watson answers a single Jeopardy question. Watson, what is polka? That is correct. There's natural language processing. There's machine learning. There's knowledge representation and reasoning. There's deep analytics. And it all happens in just three seconds. What is South Dakota? That is correct. The computation that Watson's performing is what we call embarrassingly parallel, which means that lots of different threads, different computations, are triggered all at the same time. If you tried to run Watson on a single processor, it would take a couple of hours for each question. And IBM had to create a new computing infrastructure that would allow them to do lots of parallel distributed computing to really bring down the time required to answer a question. So we set about building an optimized system. I use the word system because it's really a combination of hardware and software. That application is the king. Start with that. What are the key requirements for that and how they need to be satisfied? You bring the elements that are required to take care of that application need. We ended up using one of IBM's high-performance computing platforms, one that scales very well, meaning it can run massively parallel computations. And this was the Power7 platform. It has many, many CPUs all densely packed together, sharing memory. Most importantly, and one of the biggest things that separates Power7 is bandwidth. Watson, for example, has to access terabytes and terabytes of data to answer a question. Our processor has 500 gigabytes a second of capability. Most other processors are down below 200. The Power7 system is tuned for very rapid, deep analytics of massively parallel problems. Anytime you have to address a very specific task, you're going to have to bring together both software and hardware to create a highly optimized system from the ground up, from the chips right through the software stack for addressing the needs for that application. We believe that more and more systems will be designed for specific tasks to execute particular kinds of workloads. Watson is that. It is obviously tuned for a very particular kind of workload, call it Jeopardy. Watson wins the game. Very well played, though. Watson is the culmination of a long commitment to speech recognition, large data analytics, supercomputing, all coming together at this point in time. We knew if we could get this to work on a commercial system, the rollout into other fields of deep Q&A would be greatly accelerated. We're going to revolutionize industries at a level which has never been done before.